Oh, that's not fair. I sulked. She came to my birthday party. Yes, and your sister knows how to behave herself, unlike you David, mum replied. Close your eyes, she said. I closed my eyes tight shut as mum rinsed the shampoo from my hair. Jug after jug of water ran off my head and over my face, splashing off my shoulders and into the bath. Once rinsed, I opened my eyes. Now I want you to be a good boy and stay in your room until the girls have gone. Do you understand? But I don't want to stay in my room when Janet's having a party. I want to join in. You want to tease her friends, make fun of their dresses, pull their hair and be the centre of attention David, my mother stated. And for that reason, you shall stay in your room, out of sight, and out of mind. Well, what if I get bored and just decide to come downstairs? I said. Well you've got plenty of books and games to play with, you shouldn't get bored, mum replied as she held open a big towel. I stepped out of the bath and wrapped myself in it as mum took to my hair with a hand towel. And even if you do get bored, I think you'll find something to do that doesn't involve disturbing your sister and her friends. Well, what if I get hungry? I said. I'll have to get something to eat. I think you'll find it in yourself to wait till the girls have gone. Mum said. Now. Come on, put your vest on, she said. Mum held the gathered vest for me. I pushed my hands into the armholes and she pulled it over my head and onto my body. Hey this is one of Janet's vests. I yelped, noticing the lace trim. It is, Mum replied. And this is a pair of her knickers, she added, holding a pair white knickers also with lace trim. I'm not wearing those. Oh yes you are, Mum said calmly. And then you're going to wear one of Janet's party dresses. Why? I sulked as mum picked up my foot and stuck it though one of the lace trimmed leg holes. I'm not even going to her stupid party. No, you're going to stay in your room and be a good boy, mum said as she put my other foot through the knickers, but if like you said, you have to come downstairs for whatever reason, at least you'll be wearing a pretty dress and the girls can tease you for a change, she explained with a mischievous grin.